All right, you're gonna absolutely want to be stopping at this station here. There's pushing and shoving and everything. Have a look at this place. This is actually unbelievable. Hello, welcome to Swadi Car. My name is Rob and this is the brand new Pink Line MRT here in Bangkok. We're just here at Nontfabri Civic Centre where you can like link between the purple line and well the brand new pink line. It's like a, an achievement that's been unlocked by the city because you've got nearly 35 kilometers worth of track opened up and 30 more stations. Some of these destinations I've shown you in previous videos, but we're going to recap on some of them today. I'm going to give you five places of interest that you can visit right now. It's all coming up in today's video. All right, so it's actually uh, free for you guys to come and use this service at the moment until they put it into kind of official commercial use. And it's absolutely packed. People are really excited to be able to use this service. Like I said, 35 kilometers of track. It's a huge section. Um, so yeah, we'll jump on the next train and then uh, we'll go to our first point of interest. There's pushing and shoving and everything. Told you they were excited. All right, so I've just jumped off here at Mong Tong Tani. Um, and the importance of this station is they're gonna be doing an extension here, which reaches out to the uh, Challenger Impact Arena, which is a huge event space, which I've been to a couple of times in the past. And it's been a nightmare to get to, not only sort of time-wise, but just expensive to get a taxi out here. So it's really great to know that eventually we're gonna be able to go all the way there on these MRT lines. So yeah, this is Mong, Mong Tong, Mong Tong Tani. Ah, oh, let's move on to the next one. So I've quickly come to one of the main intersections here and it's Lac C. You can just see in the background, we've got all of the motorways. We've got like the old train line right down here. We've got the pink line MRT. And then here is the red SRT line that takes you to Dongmung Airport. So yeah, this is one of the main intersections for you to get onto the pink MRT via the red SRT to Dongmung. I'm excited to give you my first recommendation here at Vacha Rapul Station. And uh, well, actually look at the train track. It sort of goes up and over the carriageway. Uh, and the recommendation is the Liab Duan Night Market, which you can't even see from here. So if you were passing it, you wouldn't even know. You have to literally go around the corner. So you probably have to cross it underneath and then walk around the corner, kind of like two or three minutes to get there. And it's absolutely worth it. It's one of my favorite night markets in the whole of Bangkok. And it's just around the corner from this station. It's now accessible for you guys to come and check it out. And I'm really happy and if you haven't seen my video on that already I'll link it down below for you to check out trust me it's definitely worth coming here for that Thai experience night market Here we go, we are at Ramintra Court Moor 9, exit number two. You can just see the Colossal Station right behind me here. And I've been here a few times. This is a Chiba Station. It's like a Japanese themed wonderland. They've got a water park, shopping, food, drink, fashion, all sorts of stuff. And it's kind of been changing throughout the two years I've been here. And I've tried to show it off in a few videos um, because the place is really, you know, just magnificent to come and check out. During the day, it is like this. It's very quiet. There's nothing really to see or do. It's in the evenings when they've got like the car shows, the events and all sorts of stuff. They have like a live band here and you can get yourself some drinks and some food. It's just a really cool place to check out. 
See, she's even got its own bullet train that literally, it goes about one mile back. This whole venue or event, whatever you want to call it, it goes about a mile back. I'll link all of the videos that I've done here previously down below for you to check out. Yeah, this place, definitely come and check it out. About kind of seven o'clock uh, at the moment. I'd probably come on the weekends until it gets kind of more discovered, especially now that the train line is open back up. But yeah, this is the cheapest station. Remintra Core Moor 9, exit number three. That's it. Oh man, look at this. Look at this for a view. Unbelievable. This was worth stopping for. I only stopped for the view, but then I saw they had uh, the promenade here, uh, Fashion Island, and then the Grand Station over there in the corner. A bunch of places uh, to get some shopping done. And I'm not even too sure what the promenade is. I presume it's another shopping mall, but it's absolutely huge. I'm probably gonna have to come back here, do some exploring, and do a full video on the whole place. But I just stopped for that view because, man, look at it. It really is an amazing perspective miles away from Secumbit Road and all of the Kaosan Road and all of the stuff that you know. But man, what an epic view. Yeah, I'm happy I stopped here. The Outer Ring Road, Remitra. All right, you're going to absolutely want to be stopping at this station here, Noparat, for two main reasons. One of them is Siam Amazing Park. It's a theme park here in Bangkok. Now 99% of the access is done here using the MRT line. And then from here you can do, well, there's a 20 minute walk or like a two minute motor taxi ride, which is gonna cost you about 42 baht. So yeah, make your way to Noparat, five minute bike ride, and then you make, got yourself at a theme park in the middle of Bangkok. Not only is there Siam Amazing Park, but they've got Bangkok World, which is kind of like a night market themed, uh, kind of like fashion shopping area. It's quite new, but yeah, you've got two things here at Noparat, so I'm Amazing Park and Bangkok World. All right, and finally down here at Minbury, and I think, I think this is a new line. I might be completely wrong, but from what I understand, I think that's maybe the gold line, which is not even open yet. These lines are coming up all over Bangkok and I can't wait to share them with you guys. Uh, hopefully today's video was uh, helpful or useful in any way whatsoever. Uh, if there's anything you'd like to know, uh, let me know in the comments below and I'll try and help you as much as possible. It's as new to me as it is to you. I'm gonna make my way back. Uh, hopefully it doesn't take too long. But yeah, I enjoyed today's video and it's good to be back. I'll catch you guys on the next one. Peace.